This is the 2021 BrewTubers Online Brewers Club Yeast Experiment Number 2, Saison. Thank you to our sponsors, Imperial Yeast, Five Star Chemicals, Beer and Wine Hobby Homebrew Supply Store, Brewing America, all stainless steel mash paddle sponsors. Also, Hopsteiner and Yakima Chief Hops. Get brewing. What is up? Exit 12 Homebrew in the house. This is Brandon doing some 2021 yeast experiment beers, the Saison version. We do have three yeast experiments we're doing this year, and we're actually just on the last one right now. So we did a uh, Kvike, uh called Dropkick Nate. We did the Saison, and we're doing a Dubel. Um, before I get started with this review... A huge shout out to all our sponsors. Nick is going to put them right in the beautiful title card that he did. He is the man. Um, So this review is going to be under the table brewing, which is Nate in his nice, beautiful uh, label art there. So Nate used Omega Yeast Saisonstein, which is OYL. 27 027 if i'm not mistaken uh belgian style yeast so let's crack this bad boy open and see what is doing a little asmr for the people nice little hiss on that bad boy let's do a little pour for the people 2,000 years later. Okay. So, another very extremely clear Saison. Uh, you can definitely see my finger through it in my nice brew tuber's glass. Huge head on this bad boy. Um, you know, three finger head at least. Color is a golden, uh, like a golden straw color, almost like a, a lager type color. Um, let's get a nose on this bad boy. So I am getting this, uh, farmhouse funkiness a little bit and a, um, a little bit of lemon and then like a slight, uh, like orange rind almost. Um, yeah, I'm down. the yeast is, is really taking center stage in the aroma. It's like that really funky farmhouse Belgian, um, you know, sort of aroma characteristics you you sort of equate with a with a Belgian strain. Um, it's got a little bit of that funk in it, and then like a slight lemon uh, is what I'm getting on the nose. So I I just really can't wait to dig into this because Nate is an awesome brewer. So uh, cheers, Nate! Cheers to everybody in the competi- uh, competition, the yeast experiment, and let's get into this. Yeah, so right off the bat, I'm getting a huge hit of like a um, like it's like a a lemon, like a lemon zest almost. It's it's like this really uh, robust lemon flavor on the front. Then it has a nice little um, kick in the middle of that little Belgian, uh, say, you know, that Belgian yeast strain that like um, the little bit of the funkiness in it. and then it smooths out, it rounds out pretty well in the back end of, of just sort of cleaning off the palate. So it, it's definitely um, got a lot of that fruit characteristics. Um, so, yeah, it, it definitely has that um, that lemon zest. And then it's it rounds off nicely and ends with these like little fruit notes at the end, which are really nice. Um, it's just a it's just a well-rounded beer. Uh, and I'm really, really digging this bad boy. So if you're looking for Nate and everybody should be looking for Nate, his YouTube channel is under the table brewing. I believe he might have socials as well under the table brewing. Awesome, awesome, awesome brewer. One of the more seasoned brewers in our homebrew club. And I just can't say enough. Uh, I always, always enjoy Nate's beer. They're just fantastic beers. I love his uh, simplistic label art logo. Can't say nice, enough nice things about him. He's just an, a fantastic guy. Um, but I'm just going to probably just sip on this bad boy and c- 
come back at you with another bear review very shortly. If you are looking for Nick and I, you can check us out, obviously on YouTube. Please like, please subscribe, hit that little notifications button, do all that stuff. Really helpful. Um, and also, you can check us out on social, uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that at Exit 12 Homebrew. Uh, check out the podcast, all podcasting networks. Exit 12 Homebrew and Craft Beer Lifestyle Podcast. We really enjoy doing that for you guys, and, and it's a, just a super fun project. So I will see you guys later with another beer review. Cheers.